at Georgia, you got a chance to coach Anthony Edwards, who's now tearing it up in the NBA. What did he possess, coach, that like made him different, and special? Did he have it the first time you saw him play? Was he oh. was he born with it? Was it hard work? What what was his secret sauce? Well, I mean, first and foremost, you know, when I got to Georgia, the first game in April I went to go see was Anthony Edwards playing at Atlanta Express nine in the morning, wherever it was. And he was only going into his junior year. Subsequent, he reclassed up that same year. But when I seen him, he was going into his junior year. And I immediately after five minutes, like this guy's a pro. Well, this is unbelievable. This is who we're recruiting. Uh, and it was a combination of what I just said, but in his case, you know, the level of athleticism that he has is purely functional basketball. It's the highest I've ever, I've ever seen, you know, functional basketball athleticism, the physical strength. He, he's the best cutter, like anything, change of direction, everything about his athleticism. It goes to the game of basketball, you know, then you throw the physical strength on there and then his sense, his seeing, his throwing of certain passes. I was like, wow, you got that kind of athleticism and you throw those passes. That's when, you know, somebody, uh, you know, is a little different. So, and then, you know, like I told the NBA guys uh, when they would call and ask about him going into the draft, uh, you know, he was always the presumptive number one pick. So it's 16, 17 years old. Your, his kid's going to be the number one pick. You know, what that can do to a kid. Uh, and he was a kid. He was only seven. I said he came to us as a 17-year-old. He was still a kid. He was young for going to college. Uh, but what I thought was most impressive about him, what I always said was, you know what? He's got a good heart. You know, for all the things that were said about him, you're going to be this. He didn't have a bad bone in his body. He's like, a, you know, like he he had a good heart. Uh, he could have walked around thinking he was whatever he could have been a, he wasn't, I mean, he was, he was, he was always enjoyable to be around. Was he young and 17, you know, and sometimes immature. Yeah. But they all, they all are, you know, the fact that he had a good heart, you know what I mean? And not, and, and it was always that way. My thing was just put him around the right people. You know what I mean? Put him in the right environment with mature, with maturity, right? He'll, he'll, he'll take off. And I think that's what you've seen over these four years is just like sort of that uh, mature growth that he's had. Now you're saying, wow, look how good this guy is in basketball. And he sort of put all those pieces together.